So basically the mammals had a meeting and they consult the spirits and the parents, the spiritual parents, and they saw that our a spiritual is not here right now in the moment. And due to the events, the way it's unfolding, we got the uh, army here, for example, you know, with us. And they're concerned that if something was to happen to us, that maybe, you know, it, this would bring a problem for them, a like heavier consequence. That the Sierra Madre is giving a sign, maybe to avoid danger. And they're concerned about that. And they gave us some, you know, uh, teachings about their laws. They said they don't want to see no more killing there, no more spirits suffering, you know. Somebody goes there, gets killed, gets kidnapped. But they get they don't, they, that vibration will stay in the jungle, in, the, in these jungles, in these sacred, you know, places. And then the world will never end. This is where my love for extreme sports on big mountains really began. It was here I traveled with my parents in a Volkswagen camper back in 1972, an overland trip from New Brunswick to Tierra del Fuego. The journey lasted 14 months and molded my life probably more than anything else. Hey, I'm 